Alright, today we're going to do a little tutorial called Color Changing Halo Light. The reason I did one already is because I wasn't really sure how it would work yet, or how, if it would even work at all, but it did. First thing we're going to do is remove the batteries, obviously, and we're going to press any button and unscrew it. Put the new LED right here. So I was originally just going to show the wiring on camera, but I figured that um, a diagram would make this look easier. So this is for the first LED for the headlight. Now this next step is very important. This, uh, this tutorial is for LEDs with the common cathode. So... If yours is, has the common anode, you want to reverse the polarity of all the um, mentioned wires that I used. So step one, connect the negative battery wire to the uh, common side. Step two, put the positive light wire to the red side and put a resistor on the red side. You may have to play around with the resistors to get the desired color. Step two, put a resistor on the green side and bridge the red to the green with a wire. Next, bridge the green side to the blue side. You do not need a resistor for the blue side. Now finally, connect a wire to the blue side of the LED that goes to the forward side of the motor. You'll have to figure that out yourself, as well as the positive light wire. And then, for more off, warm white hue that I did. It's our ground wire right there. So red, that's the uh, headlight wire, and it's bridging to the green to get our yellow, and then blue to get our white from the motor, which that blue side does have a resistor. Well, we're going to go with the cooler white, because that's how I had it. Now the process for the second LED is very similar, but there's a couple of differences with the wiring. Connect another battery wire to the common side of the second LED. Put a resistor on the red side, then bridge the red side to the green side, then put the positive headlight wire on it. Then connect the blue and green sides together. Then attach the blue side to the motor, positive direction. Now, if you want to see more applications with the RGB lights, I can show you more. This is the first one I happen to think of. And like I said, you can't adjust these, so if they're not yellow enough or whatever, you can change the resistance to one side. But because there's two lights, it kind of throws it off. Anyway, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. It's the first, of, it's the first tutorial I've made. And... I don't make them that often because sometimes it gets frustrating, but yeah, there's my shot at a tutorial.
DJ. 